occurred uh, during the first hour when uh, Charlie Cook and Steve Kern were wrestling against uh, the Freebirds. Uh, the match was going along. The fact of the matter is it certainly looked like things were going extremely well for Steve and for Charlie. Uh, we had to cut away to a commercial break. Now, uh, as we did that, uh, a sudden series of events took place. Well, luckily, of course, as we always do, we always have a standby camera so that in the event anything should happen, as it did today, uh, we'll be able to bring it to you in its entirety. So we're going to pick up uh, that match just as we had broken away for the commercial, and uh, you'll see what happened uh, while you were enjoying a commercial message at that particular point in time. And it is uh, Charlie Cook and uh, Steve Kern both exploding. Steve Kern and Charlie Cook exploding on the Freebirds, and they've got the Freebirds in a lot of trouble here. Michael Hayes, ah, ah, Charlie Cook. Michael Hayes separated those ropes. Charlie Cook out onto the concrete, and Steve Kern it catches, he caught Michael Hayes. Steve Kern catches Michael Hayes, and now Terry Gordy and uh, Buddy Roberts both on top of uh, Steve Kern. You've got two on one. Wait a minute. Michael Hayes after that cream, and he's after uh, Steve Kern. He's got that jar of cream or whatever it is, and we've got uh, the two of them holding Steve Kern. Buddy Roberts trying to get... Uh, do that now and wait a second wait a second the junkyard dog tommy rich and uh tony atlas mr hercules in there and uh they tony atlas the junkyard dog and tommy rich and they've cleared the ring they've cleared the ring but they also they also got the uh, it looks to me like uh, yes the junkyard dog got the uh that jar he got the jar and all right, a disqualification. Well, I was totally mystified by that entire situation, as you could tell by the way I was describing it. I see right now that Mrs. Mrs. Hayes, she liked to dig into her pants and get a little jar, but a jar, I got the jar now. And tomorrow night nominee, when all like I told you, when those people get their hand from the raptors, hollering and screaming, foaming at their mouth, you might just see yourself a bald head sissy running around here. But Tommy, you know, I can't wait to sissy. Can you picture Hayes with no hair? Hayes, think about it. Tomorrow night at Omni, brother. Omni. Things, things may not look good right now, but keep one thing in mind. Before tomorrow comes, you got to get through tonight in Chattanooga. And I can make up some more cream. Granted, they'll have the, they'll have the original, which is the worst. But I can make up some more. And while your eyes are watching them, don't forget that my eyes will be upon you. Well, we've heard the comments from a very, very frustrated Michael Hayes, a man who uh, I have never seen him uh, uh, drifting so closely to the edge of that uh, precipice. And uh, Where do you find these idiots? That's what I want to know. I don't, care to, talk cages to, or I don't care to talk to you at all anymore, Mr. Hayes. All I care to do right now is just to remind you once again that, of course, next week, uh, Georgia Championship Wrestling back at its full two hours, and that'll be uh, from 5.30 until 7.30.